What's going on guys, Garrett here, and today we're going to be talking about first person in GTA 5 and what I am most excited for and what you are most excited for. Now, I want to know in the comment section what you are most excited for in GTA 5 next year when it comes to the first person mode. What is the first thing you want to do once you get first person mode enabled? I reached out to some of you guys on Twitter and Facebook and asked you exactly what you are most excited for and what you look forward to the most, and you guys have some very, very similar answers that I'll show you guys at the end of this video but first i want to share some of the things that i am most excited for when it comes to gta 5 next gen first person and let's jump right into it so the first thing i want to talk about is driving now, i am very excited about gta 5 first person driving i think that is a very very cool aspect when it comes to jet skiing driving cars driving motorcycles and even piloting planes and helicopters i think that is going to be a huge game changer for me it's gonna be a whole new experience especially flying things like the laser which enables you to really get like that battlefield-esque feel to i guess gta online or gta 5 when you get to actually play or fly the laser in a more cockpit view and only have like very limited viewing ability so very very cool my opinion hopefully you guys look forward to flying as well in addition to that i also look forward to parachuting i want to see what it's gonna look like to parachute and i think it might add a little something to the game especially when you have to deploy a parachute and things like that now i know a lot of you guys were excited about the shooting mechanics and some of you guys even said that you're excited for the suicide mechanics when you actually put the, the gun to your head and pull the trigger that it might look cool to do that in first person not exactly sure how that's gonna work but overall i think that the first person i guess mode that they're bringing to gta 5 and gta line is gonna be something that's gonna be sort of game changing and it's a different way to look at the game now we're all used to seeing third person and we know what the game looks like in third person but playing it again over in the gta 5 single player and playing gta line in first person will really be a whole new experience for me hopefully you guys do feel the same so let's jump into some of the i guess comments you guys left in regards to what is the most i guess anticipated thing for you when it comes to first person and first off we have steven on facebook he says to pick up a hooker next one we have tyrone green he says have sex with a prostitute next one's diego hookers <laughs> alejandro hit up this club and search for the bitches <laughs> so very common trend here except for adam he says fist fight and getting over by cars i think that's also be cool fist fighting might be really really cool next up we have juan he says he wants to jump off mount Chiliad with the parachute that is a really really cool thing to do and i really want to experience that as well juan maybe you'll be able to do it with me i'll oh, be do it with me that sounds weird after just going over strippers but be able to play with me once we get the next gen as i will be live streaming doing open lobbies next up we have sebastian he says getting a blowjob in first person does that make it better than a blowjob in third person <laughs> and then um that's pretty much it that we have for the comments you guys sent in but pretty much you guys really want to see what the strippers are like there's the prostitutes and uh <laughs> All the blowjobs and sex in first person. So hopefully, Roger does enable you guys to see that. They probably won't do that, but maybe they will. You never know. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure you guys do drop a like. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with a new video. <laughs> Later, guys.